how bad do you want to win? Now, folks, you understand the head coach's responsibility is to put the best folks out there on the field, right? Now, folks, I can't make you, I can't demand. See, that, you know, this is one of the differences now in A.O. Williams and some of this, uh, this highbrow universities like uh, Harvard and Yale and places like that, where, where they see they got their philosophy about intimidation, distant management, all, but see, I don't believe that. I believe in getting in there. I believe in the leader being an example. I believe in the leader not ever asking your people to do something you won't do first, right? I believe the leader prove, go proves by his actions that this thing pays off. I'm gonna work harder than you. I'm gonna love it more than you. I'm gonna compete harder than you. And I'm gonna give you an example of a stud. I'm gonna prove to you it ain't gonna be easy. I don't promise you're gonna be easy. I promise you're gonna be double tough. But I promise you, you watch this dude. And I decide to pinch my tent at A.O. will you? This where I'm gonna do it or not do it. I ain't gonna quit with you. I ain't gonna quit. You wanna quit? I understand why you wanna quit. I wanna quit every dadgum day and go out there and get a good job, right? Okay, but I promise you, you quit, folks, this train's gonna truck on down. I'm gonna give you everything I got. I'm gonna give you my energy. I'm gonna give you my ability. I'm gonna give you my positive attitude. I'm gonna be there to help you. I'm not gonna play games. This is my life. This is everything I wanna do with my life. I intend to deliver. I intend, if you love it like I love it, if you wanna win like I wanna win, if you wanna make a difference with your life, I intend for you to be everything you've ever dreamed about becoming at A.O. Williams. Your dreams will come true at A.O. Williams. Winning is everything for Art Williams. But I can flat tell you, if you lay down on us, you quit on us in the fourth quarter, then folks, I can flat tell you, we're just gonna have it, have, we're gonna put you over on the bench. Now we're not gonna be ugly to you. I don't believe in that, right? Because I understand why you quit. I understand why you don't want to keep trucking. I don't know why I'm made like I'm made. I know I'm a mad man. But all I know is that A.O. Williams was built for those that want to continue to win, continue to grow, continue to compete. They just don't wear out. They just don't quit. Let me tell you this. The biggest single difference I see from those giants in A.O. Williams, I'm talking about the Bob Saffords and the Kip Ridleys and the Neil Askews. And the biggest single difference I see in those people and the people that just don't ever get there is they don't quit. Now that's pretty. That's a pretty fascinating dadgum statement. You understand? I didn't say the biggest difference is they're smarter, prettier, taller, right sex. I didn't say none of that crap. IQs. I didn't say none of that, right? I said the biggest difference I see in the giants in A.O. Williams and those that talk like they, they want to be a giant, okay, but just could never perform is these people never quit. They never quit believing, they never quit trying, they never quit hoping, they never quit being loyal. Now they wanted to every day, but they never quit. I believe a winner looks for reasons to try. I believe a winner his whole life looks for reasons to win. I believe a loser on the other hand looks for reasons to make excuses. I believe that. I believe a loser looks for reasons every day not to compete. I believe a loser looks for reasons every day not to try. I believe a loser spends his whole life looking for reasons not to win. Just always look, blaming the leadership, blaming the economy, blaming every personal problem, blaming everything. Let's see the winner. The winner builds his whole life looking for reasons to win looking for reasons to be excited, looking for reasons to be optimistic, looking for reasons to be happy, look for reasons to give them a reason to try one more time, to get it up one more time.